Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover and thank you for joining me here. So today we're going to continue playing as the Desert Rangers and decide which path we will take with our focus tree. So right now we need to do Ran Ranger General Appointment and basically focus on what we're going to do. I've made the decision that we in time must have allies. Also we are justifying on the Vault City people because I need more factories. So. I have made the decision to go with a certain path, and that includes not doing the independent path and creating the Nevada Pact just because of circumstances in the current game. By that, I mean this. When I was looking at cities or countries that I needed to take out, I was looking at cities or factions, countries, that had the most manpower so I could puppet them and core, or at least puppet them and abuse their manpower. My initial place that I wanted to core or you know take over and puppet was New Reno, just because they have quite a bit of manpower. And out of ev all of my neighbors, New Reno itself has a crap ton of manpower, or at least population. So that was the best place for me to puppet. Now, that being said, I can't attack them because they have chosen to go down the intellectual path. That means by going down the intellectual path that they will eventually ally the Brotherhood of Steel, or I guess the Western Brotherhood of Steel. So, do I want to fight the Western Brotherhood? I could if I ally with the NCR, but if I ally with the Western Brotherhood of Steel, and ultimately with New Reno, then I could help take down the NCR, take a lot of factories and territory for myself, and eventually get access to the Scorpions, who is another really great group to puppet. Yes, they are, what are they, raiders, savages? They are raider nation. But, they have no national spirits, and this is important. They have no national spirits that make them turn a certain way or believe in a certain ideology, at least so far. And they have a lot of manpower or population in their quite a few states. So, I think this would be a great place to puppet eventually. So, I'm pretty much decided to not do the Nevada Pact, but to eventually just go down for the Brotherhood of Steel Path, which was my original plan to do. So that's really my goal. I gave this an incredible amount of uh, attention and thought into who I was going to ally with or create a faction or anything like that. It actually took me a long time to figure out what I was going to do after I got everyone's feedback. Um, there was someone who wanted me to play, as NC play with the NCR, which was great and fun. I mean, if I play as, play as a Desert Rangers again, I'll probably do that. I gave consideration of being independent, which would actually be fairly difficult, but not impossible. And I actually have played several times allied with the Brotherhood, the Western Brotherhood, so I might as well do that. But the most important thing for me was just looking down here, whether I ally with the Brotherhood or ally with the NCR, because if you ally with the Brotherhood and you go to war with the Troll Warren or Washington Brotherhood, in both sides of the tree here, for the Brotherhood as well as the NCR, you get this modifier eventually that gives you plus 10% breakthrough and soft attack, which I think is amazing, which I really, really love, because I want as much breakthrough as possible. Soft attack is great, it's very important, but breakthrough makes you take less damage, and that's what I really want. And secondly, I went with the Brotherhood just because I am a massive slut for power armor. I am sorry, I just love power armor so much. Yes, we won't get as good power armor as the Enclave, or as the Western Brotherhood, it's the wa the Western Brotherhood of Steel as itself, but whatever. So right now, here's the plan. I'm going to take out Vault City, and just annex them. Then I'm going to immediately justify on the Sky Reavers, because this is another good place, in my opinion. <laughs> Gender equality through violence, I love it. But, um, I think this is another good place that we could puppet and do pretty well with. I have played this a little bit ahead of time, just to see how things were acting up. Ooh, 30,000, 31,000 people there, nice. Antelope's tribes, Claire Warren, Cyclops' tribes, very nice. But, I want to go to war with the Sky Reavers just because I think that would be a great place for me to just puppet more manpower and then move on from there. I'm mostly going to annex most of my enemies, but I will leave, like, like I said, some room for puppets like Scorpions, Sky Reavers. The White Legs might be a good thing to puppet as well, but we'll see what happens. But everyone like north of me really sucks unless you get to the Troll Warren or the Washington Brotherhood. Heaven's Gate isn't super great as well at the at least at the current moment. So trying to find people that have a lot of manpower is a little difficult. I mean it is the wasteland, but ooh. 
That's good. And besides, if I wanted to go to war with the Brotherhood, I would need both anti-tank and auto laser rifles for enough piercing so I could do enough damage. And in this playthrough, I don't think I have enough time or strength to really do that. But anyways, that actually opens up more paths for me to do different support equipment. Including recon, which actually is very important, as well as logistic companies. As well as medical companies as well. Medical companies... Anti-tank is so good to do. Actually, it's probably good to do recon as well. But let's go ahead and throw on some machine guns. I'm going to do this. Give me about that many. Do that. Good. And go ahead and just plop them on to everything. Because they will be important. Muy importante. Nice. So far, so good. Because I think machine guns will be very, very useful. Because... With the machine guns, they give you plus 26 to... Defense, more soft attack, a little bit of suppression and suppression bonus, a little more HP and heart attack. Take a little bit more supply, Don't doesn't really hurt our organization too much, as well as piercing or weight. So that, I think, ultimately is not a bad idea. And I want to make sure I don't screw this up. And I want Thrasher Sagara. Thank you. Thank you very much. Let's go with him to get some political power. Cool. Also, uh, with the Brotherhood of Steel Path, you get bonuses to infantry production. Ooh, you get more 5% more breakthrough almost immediately, which is good. Steel Rangers, so we'll become the Steel Rangers instead of the Desert Rangers. Um, I get funding, more construction speed, which is the same thing as the NCR would give you if you allied with them. You get better infantry equipment production, which is awesome. And over here, you also get a further 15% construction bonus as well. But this is what I really like. When we go to war with the NCR... You get fit, minus 15% infantry combat width, which means that I can actually throw in another militia division to my standard infantry division. Or I can throw in a militia battalion into my infantry divisions so that they just get stronger with while still being almost 20 combat width, which is awesome. Very, very awesome. And I do probably need to start making a little bit of support equipment for... Ooh... Oh, oh, actually, oh, oh, I need more military, uh, factories, and that's why I gotta go to war with Vault City. I need to save a little bit of my political power so I can save it for the Sky Reavers, because they will go to war with the Grabber Territory eventually. That'll be good. It looks like the Antelope Tribes are at war with the Cyclops Tribes, so. Very nice, very, very nice. So, awesome. Um, in my own spare time, I have honestly been playing a little bit of Fallout 4. I know it's not the best Fallout game, but I've just gotten into such a Fallout jam that... I figured I might as well play it. Cool, resistors, nice, better construction, better research speed. Let's get some better encryption next. But yeah, just fall off board just because I have it on act. I have it, I have it, uh, it's easy for me to get to it on my PlayStation. I don't have it for PC, so. Hmm, 120. I do want to go with War Economy. It's a good thing that we have Melo Killborn for Army XP gain. Uh, with the Thrasher... We can go eventually with Hell's Rate. We can't go with this, which kind of sucks. We can get more planning speed, max planning, which isn't great. Whatever. But but we can still get Hell's Razor because he's not the current leader of the Rangers. So we lose a little bit, little bit of defense for more attack. Sounds good to me. We lose some stability for better supply consumption. Sounds good to me. Uh, just a lot of the stuff sounds really good to me. Could be biased, but whatever. Well, since we're going to be at war soon, I want to make sure I get enough breakthrough and organization. So, and can I do anything over here? No. All right, let's let time go on. Still nothing I can do. So, more attack in exchange for defense. Defense is great. I don't really want to lose defense, but 20% attack could mean a big, could be a big difference. Vision recovery rate... And I will be attacking immediately, and the supply consumption shouldn't affect us too much at the moment. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go with attack. I love attacking. And I will need as much of an advantage as I can get. Yeah, defense kind of sucks now, but whatever. Recon companies, very nice. Very, very nice. Um, Defense breakthrough. That sounds very, very important. Oh, dang, I missed a day. But let's get some research speed first. Whatever, I missed a day. Things happen. Kaiser's Legion declares war on twin mothers. So be it. Looks like... Oh, there we go. I was waiting for this. Honestly, the war against these guys shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, we need some more machine guns, but whatever. This shouldn't be too bad. But then again, I've been wrong before. Let's go ahead and move in. 
take a collection of everyone. Send one of you guys this way. You guys will immediately come this way. And then you guys will immediately... Uh, actually... I want you to end up that way. I want you to just come here. You will just continue pushing here. And then you'll push that way. So we can split these guys off. Nice. And not bad. Not bad so far. Let them attack us. Let us have a great time with each other. Actually, yeah. Go ahead and just try to cut these guys off. That'll probably be, honestly, the most important thing. Great. Now we've encircled them, kind of. Just push them and take the territory if you can. And ca get Carlin. Awesome. Oh, and they're trying to rescue some of the guys here. Oh, actually, that's not good. I can't pierce their divisions. All right, well, if you want to attack me, I will attack you right back. Very good. Do you have anything over here? Nope. And that's okay. Go ahead, guys. I don't think these guys are going to put too, up too much of a challenge. Take Battle Mountain. Awesome. Immediately attack this way so they can't move and encircle us. Get some more reinforce rate. Awesome. Just go come over here and do that. Not too bad, not too bad. Why don't you do this? And once these guys are over here, we are going to do that. So take these guys out. Awesome. And they are... The light robots are gone. This side is almost conquered and done. It's done. Awesome. Go ahead and give them three seconds before I execute order. Kill the Vault City people. Yeah. Awesome. Just go ahead and march straight on in. And boom. Thank you. I got encircled, but not really. These guys can't stop us. Yay, more breakthrough in organization after most of the war is already over. Whatever. Oh, we can produce more infantry equipment. That'll be important because I need as much military factories as possible. And because of that... Oh, they already took out the Pale Folk, so we annexed them already. Nice. Cool. Oh, I should have immediately justified on this group who are justifying on the Grabber Territories. 160 days. Hopefully the Grabber Territories can last that long. If not, whatever. <sighs> yeah, let's try that immediately. If we had run out of supply, so be it. Militarize society, lose stability for war support. Eh, that's alright. Right now, do we have... We need more anti-personnel stuff. I'm going to get rid of light robots because I'm not even going to use them. Oh, we got plenty of infantry equipment. So, I need some more of this. So, I'm going to take you guys off. Put you on there. Put you on here. Do that, and then do that. I think that would be pretty good. Rangers, you need some recon for more defense, breakthrough. Oh, yeah, that actually gives you more breakthrough. Nice. I mean, it's only by one point, but that's still pretty important. You guys, machine guns. Give me machine guns. Awesome. Now, are we going to suffer supply issues down here? Because I'll take my rangers off if needed. No? Alright. Very nice. Very nice. Militarized society. Workbench instru instruction. Good. Good, good, good. Yeah, we just need more machine guns. So we have up to 51 factories. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Go ahead and repair everything up here. And I was a little disappointed when I tried this earlier, but I might as well share it with you now. The Enclave Reborn mod made it so that when you annexed or took over Vault City, you got some benefits, but I guess in Old World Blues, not quite so much at the current moment. Kind of sucks, but whatever. Uh, New Reno. Ooh, the Klamath deal. Hmm. Interesting what these guys are doing. Up, and there they go with the Sky Reavers. We've got enough political power to do something here. Uh, I want War Economy, but whatever. I can't choose anybody here because we haven't completed these focuses yet. Uh... Thrasher is not the current leader yet. Okay. But he is. Okay. Hmm. Tactically minded. Let's see. Lose stability for ex effects of our partisans. Less supply consumption. Uh, Ranger instructor. Don't really need that. I'm not really going to focus too much on Rangers, honestly, in this playthrough. Fighters, agility, max speed. Tactical bomber equipment, reliability. Hmm. Well, let's go do with electronics research speed just because I'm going to be utilizing the research speed bonus that we can get by quite a bit as we do more tech stuff. Bone pickers. Uh, actually, the bone dancers seem like a good place. I could um, puppet as well for manpower. 
I think they would be a pretty good place. Ooh, do we actually have a plane? Oh, we have one scrapyard dive bomber. I love it. Workbench institutions or instructions. Database sharing for better infantry tech. I love it. Cool. We've got a whole plane. Let's see, the Sky Reavers seem to be doing okay. We still have less than 100 days before we can go to war with them. We are still slowly mobilizing more men, which is totally fine. Honestly, if the Sky, Grab Sky Reavers destroy the Grabber territories, I'm fine with that. Um, I don't really care. These guys shouldn't be too hard to kill off, but if anything, that just opens up the front to be a little bit wider. Ooh, roll out more tech to scavengers. Yes, please. Smoke signals, nice. Decryption, industry, let's get some more construction speed. Ooh, nice, free civilian factories. I could really use those. Mm, right now, we could use more military factories. What about building uh, every other one? 50, then do 40. I want to put them in places far away from the NCR because we're going to end up at war with them eventually. Cool. New Vegas declared war on the Great Cons, and New Vegas declared war on... NCR declared war on someone else. Let's see. Oh, army plus 10% breakthrough. Yes, please. Uh, let's see. Who is the NCR? Oh, the NCR is at war with Scorpions. Interesting. Yeah, actually, if we take over the NCR, I eventually could take a bunch of NCR territory and then pop at the Scorpions. I think that might be for the best. Um, yeah, do more decryption. That stuff is good to do. See, 76% war t world tension, NCR scorpions. Oh, they actually lost quite a few. Quite a few. But where is it? Sky Reavers, there you are. For Rachel. Who the hell is Rachel? Uh, about, mm, that's pretty comparable, actually. Database sharing, very nice. And commander, Knight Commander Drills. More army XP, which is pretty useful. Frankly, I'm kind of surprised that the Grabber Territories haven't capitulated as much yet, but I'm, mm, I don't know. They have less manpower. And the Sky Reavers do have more divisions. Maybe it's because I am preparing to go to war with these guys to the point where the Sky Reavers know that they better be ready for a war with me. Maybe? Perhaps? I don't know. See what happens. For a militarized society, I basically get more war support from doing that. Scavenge for equipment... Well, I think I'm okay. I just need more close air support and stuff like that. New Vegas? What is going on with New Vegas? Oh, New Reno declared one of the Klamathians. Interesting. Oh, New Vegas, you're getting kind of thick. Oh, baby. And now you're war with a damn... Ooh, Vegas. Vegas is going to be a little bit of a powerhouse down there. Yay, another infantry division. Klamath against New Reno. Wow. They have these two tiles to fight between each other. Isn't that just lovely? So... Now I can go to war with these guys. Hmm. Let's go ahead and do that. Obviously the Grabber ter Terrorists won't get too much if I go to war with them. 145 days. I wonder if that will be lowered if I go to war with them after I declare a war on the Sky Reavers. I want to do that and immediately justify on their enemy. Nope. Doesn't change, but doesn't matter to me. Cool. Let. What is the best place for me to attack? I think right here might be the best place. I want all but one to attack. So the four are left here. Take off one more, come up that way, and take one more off and come up that way. Let's see what happens. Oh, that's pretty nice. That's that's pretty nice, not gonna lie. And just keep beating them back, encircle a few divisions. If we can, if we can't, just tell my guys to go right on ahead. Should have no problems, but then again, you never know. Oh, yep, we're having, encountering some red. Ooh, another division, please. Thank you. Not bad. It's always good to attack your enemies when they're attacking someone else. They've lost over a thousand, which is good. And they can't really hold us back for too long, which is awesome. Knight Commander Drills, more army XP, and we will begin, once this focus is done, be known as the Steel Rangers. Let's go ahead and lower it down to balanced because I don't want to take too many casualties. Actually, don't need to guard the lands that contain me with, or yeah, between me and the grabber territories just yet. Oh, all right, give us a little bit more time. I want to 
give my guys enough planning, and go right ahead. Nice. I think that was a capital. We have Area 51 now. Cool. Encoded signals. Go and take Crystal Springs, and that should be it for the enemy. Reinforce rate. Research speed. Hmm. Explosive soft support attack. Soft attack. Soft support attack? What's support? It's soft support attack. Hmm. Ooh, baby. Things aren't looking good for the Sky Reavers. They're almost gone. They're almost capitulated. You guys don't need to do that. Just make your way down here. Ooh. Oh, man. If we could attack here, that'd be awesome. Uh, take two guys. Come on. Oh, uh, they're adding more soldiers here, which isn't good for us. So, if they want to do that, I will do this. Well, actually, yeah. I've cut off all the territories from the Grabber territories to here. New Vegas declared war on the Mojave... Wow, okay. Someone's got some balls. Whew. Oh, and they're attacking us here. Very nice. Then us. A little bit more troublesome than I initially thought, but that's okay. Make sure these guys can't move. And there we go. Cool. Uh, grab your territories don't deserve anything because they were slowly getting pushed back, so there we go. Uh, oh, and actually, give me a little bit of time with their own factory so I can use them and abuse them. Alright, enough time with that. Occupied territory, Sky Reavers. Yes, please, you are my puppet now. Awesome. You will be who I abuse. What? Never mind, uh, I didn't say that. Uh, let's see, Sky Reavers. Cool. Let's see, what do they have? That's defensive divisions. This isn't bad. Infantry template one isn't bad either. Machine gun brigades. What about two? Twenty combat with it. Nice. This isn't bad either. Um, that's imp division two. That's twenty-two combat with. That's fifteen. Yeah, this is what we want to duplicate. So go ahead and do that. Save as zero. Infantry template one. Uh, yeah. This is actually not bad. Put some machine gun support. Put some recon on there. I want to train. What's their manpower like? I know we killed some of these guys. Hmm. Not bad. And they're going to get more more uh, population, which isn't bad either. Stolen blueprints, slavers. Ooh. Enslaving scientists. Nice. Iron grip. I like that one. Uh, they, they're they intellectuals. Because we're intellectuals. We're so smart, guys. Cool. So, yeah. Instead, do that and set it up so that... You come over here, make two at a time. And once we have enough divisions, I will go ahead and lower my division count. But that's good. That's actually really good for us. Need more anti personnel. Of course, my infantry, they only have. Actually, let's go ahead and change everyone to Rangers. They only have infantry for their combat, which isn't the greatest, but isn't the worst either. Cool. So getting ready to go to war with Grabber Territories, awesome. Not going to feed my puppet anything because I want the factories for myself. We got clay working done. Um, but I'm, ooh, yeah, more monthly population. Thank you. Man, I hit my keyboard hard. Steel Rangers, very nice. Very, 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 very nice. And we get some more funding for more construction speed and four more military factories. So we need more infantry equipment, a little bit more anti-personnel guns, and a little bit more close air support, which I forgot to use. I have it, I just forgot to use these things. Nice. Very nice. We could build these... We already have enough. Do that. Do that. Do that. Guns will come along in due time. Not bad. Not bad at all. Yeah, for these guys, I just don't think there's enough manpower for me to justify puppeting them when I could take their factories for myself. 2,000 people on a tile, or a region, another 2,000 precise targeting. 2,000, yeah, I mean, 11,000 is nice, but I, I want more. I want more. I'm greedy, man. I'm absolutely greedy. Um, that's a little bit ahead of time. Defense, more of that. Definitely want this to save my own divisions. Very nice. And these guys actually have radar, huh? Um, okay, the NCR declared war on the Mojave Raiders. Okay, I thought they went to war with the Mojave Chapter, which is a little different. A little bit different. But I do need to watch when the Brotherhood, if they do this, if they go to... Oh, I'm, I'm in a faction with them. If they do end up in a war with 
the NCR because I will need to be called into that as soon as possible because I need their territory. So they have their own faction. I'm in the Brotherhood of Steel immediately. Very nice. Very nice stuff. No war economy yet for me. Disappointing. Dedicated scrap for more research speed and electronics research speed, which actually sounds pretty good. Let's do that immediately. 58 factories, not bad. How many more days do we have until we can take out grabber territories? Not too many more days. Maybe a week. <gasps> oh my god, yes! Oh, power armor. Thank you. Thank you for unlocking that, because that was actually... I got that because they just finished their own focus under Ranger Paladin, so I unlocked the T-45D power armor and then welcoming committee. Oh, they're going to give me a unit of paladins later on. Oh, power armor division, yes. Yes. Uh, I, oh, I can't even make my own power armor divisions. Well, I, I can make these, but I can't increase the size of these divisions, which kind of sucks, but in due time, we will be able to. I'm going to choose Trooper Warfare under Conventional Warfare just because I get 5% more population, which will be very, very necessary for our future Brotherhood of Steel funding. Very nice. And we'll go with more infantry equipment production so that we can do r war with the bear as soon as possible. Nice. Let's go ahead and go to war with these guys. I don't think that these guys will be really ready for us if we go to war with them. Um... I'm going to call my puppet in, even though... There you go. I think we should be okay by doing this. And they just joined the war. Okay, new Reno joined the Brotherhood of Steel. See, that's why I was talking about, that they joined uh, the brother Brotherhood of Steel, so I figured I might as well. Um, yeah, I mean, they want me to go to war with Klamath and Grabber territory. I mean, I guess. I don't really care. <sighs> Mojave Brother has been called in. Okay, so actually right now the Brotherhood's very large. Oh, actually, oh, I didn't realize that the Sky Reavers did have a claim down here. I don't mind giving them that if they have a claim. I don't know if that's a core, though. Join wars. Yeah, whatever. Point 0.11, that's good enough for me. Brotherhood of Steel is becoming very large. Now, if I chose to be with the NCR... That might that would have radically changed the wastes as well. So, I'm going to be nice. I'm going to give you my puppet this, and I'm going to take the rest because I need it. Very nice. Yeah, they don't have anything over there. Very nice. Helped out my puppet. They got a colony state. Whatever. Um, for my puppet though, do they actually have in their focus tree to get or core some lands? I don't believe so. Shiny new toys. No, 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 no. Critical thinking. Iron grip. Territorial reinforcements. Lightning. Takes, taking what we need. Business booms. Howitzers. Yeah, I don't think so. I could be wrong. It might be a decision, but at the current moment, they don't have it, so... That's as much territory as they're probably going to get. And since we're still going to be waiting for war against whomever... And I probably don't need to help our allies taking out Klamath territory because I don't really care about them. Uh, yeah, not bad. Brother to Steel is basically surrounding the NCR at this point. Uh, to be honest with you, I don't care about this. So. It'd be nice to just take it, but I'm not going to. New Reno honestly des deserves all of this, so let's do that. And New Reno has gotten a little bigger. Maybe in the end I will backstab my allies, but at the current moment, New Reno is placed far away from New Reno. Very nice. So basically, the, the NCR is screwed. I mean, they're pretty much screwed if we go to war with them. Oh, these guys are still fighting. Mermuck tribes died. Ooh, healing powder. I love it. Machine guns. Engineering. Good. Let's do that next. Oh, no location set. It's fine. Don't really care. Inventory template. Medical companies don't have... Oh, I do. Nice. Do that. Definitely need this, because those are actually pretty important to do. National Guards. Don't really need them. Not going to use them. Iron Alliance declared war on Scorpion Bites. Not bad. You guys. Oh. I have neglected you a little bit. Nice. Ooh, we got several things done there. Can I do that? Nope. Can't do that, because I would have too many special forces then. 
Alright, the only thing we can do currently is begin Ranger Reorganization. Awesome. And we can get rid of basic weaponry for advanced energy weapons, which is actually very good. Start making some power armor as well when you get there. Cool. That'll be very important. We need more support equipment. We need some more advanced weaponry, which is just so much better than your basic ballistic stuff, so... Actually, that weaponry is all the way to the right. The best advanced energy weaponry that we can get. Super Mutant Club. Hmm. A lot of army XP. This is very nice. Very, very nice. Let's see. Down here. Go ahead and repair all these things for ourselves. What is the manpower of the Sky Reavers? Not bad. Not bad. They're dealing with chems. Division training time is going better. Val oh, actually, the Mexican Baja California Mexicans are killing each other. Huh. I've never seen that happen before. Oh, and here we go. The first set of our Sky Reaver inspired divisions has joined us. Awesome. How many more days do we have with these guys? Uh, I'm not going to train these guys now. You might as well not. Let's see. What was I thinking of? I was thinking of something. I can't remember now. Oh, what is the percentage? of manpower being used for this template. How do I check that? I don't remember how to check that. Right now, we could use more infantry equipment, probably. Oh, that's tank equipment production. More military factory construction speed. Community outreach isn't bad. Non-core manpower. Yeah, we'll do that one. Oh, look at all that political power. Focus on the internal sphere. Stability. War support. Pop, pop, roll out more technology. Awesome. And come on, we've taken out. How many people have we taken out this episode? Two? Yeah, I think we've taken out. Well, oh, technically three. I'm averaging three now on every front, which is pretty cool. Tactically minded. Uh, I don't want to do that now, but okay, go ahead. Go right ahead. Gives us even more bonus when we attack right now. These guys honestly won't last. I'm just going to annex them straight into my lands when we do go to war with them, which will be in the next episode. So guys, yeah, we've done great. We have gone to war with Vault City, the Sky Reavers, as well as the Gravit ter Territories, and expanded our industrial capacity by a whole lot. We've joined the Brotherhood of Steel. We're now known as the Steel Rangers. And honestly, when we go to war with the NCR, they're going to have a bad time. Even though I do need to make sure, holy crap, I didn't realize they took out New Vegas. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like if you liked the video. Subscribe if you're new. And I will see you tomorrow as we... Have a great time in the Nevada wastes. Thanks for watching.